three, two, one. From sunny Atlanta, I'm Dave Cohen sending happy birthday wishes, 50th birthday wishes to Rod Wood and all my friends at WSYR TV Channel 9 in Syracuse. But I've got to admit, I'm a little bit confused. You see, when I started in Syracuse TV 40 years ago, it was at WSYR TV Channel 3. When I left broadcast television in Syracuse 30 years ago, I left Channel 9. WIXT. Now I'm sending along these birthday wishes back to WSYR TV Channel 9. So I guess you could say I have come full circle. My memories of the days at Channel 9 from 1978 to 1982 were filled with great memories. I remember covering the Henley England Regatta. The Syracuse crew team won the IRA and they sent them to England and Channel 9 sent us to uh, cover that as a documentary. I remember doing three shows on the building of the Carrier Dome, actually walking over the roof of the dome, bouncing on the Teflon roof. I remember the time I had Sergeant Slaughter, the wrestler, come on live during my sportscast. He put me in the Cobra clutch and I was turning blue on the air, but fortunately he let go but threatened the weatherman with more of the same if he didn't come through with a good for golfing the following day. Well, my time at Channel 9 also meant that I was a footnote to broadcast history because when I jumped from Channel 3 to Channel 9, I actually blazed the trail for Bud Hedinger, who followed the same route from Channel 3 to Channel 9, coming from his career as a weatherman, becoming a news anchor at Channel 9. All of that happened in uh, the early 1980s. So I've had some great memories of my time at Channel 9, and we also had the chance to do live broadcasts of Syracuse football and basketball, but one lingering memory that I still carry with me is this, the bus card that they put me on. This is Jim Rose, who went on to a great career as a sportscaster in Chicago. And I can't figure out who this handsome devil is with all the hair. Could it be me? Anyway, let's go back now to all my friends at WSYR-TV Channel 9 in Syracuse.